So I just had an inquiry through Instagram and I thought I'd do a very quick live demonstration of how I attempt to close the deal. Hello. Hi, I'm a... Hi, speaking. Hi, it's George here from GDE London. Oh, George, how's it going? Very well, thank you. Yourself? Yeah, very good, thank you. Very good. Good, good. I see you are interested in that Lamborghini Hurricane. Just seen your message on Instagram. Yeah, funny enough, just saw it pop up in my stories earlier and uh, the spec really caught my eye. Yeah, it's lovely. It is a lovely example and probably has to be seen in person to be truly appreciated. But um, how can I help? Yeah, so George, I've just sold my Lamborghini Gallardo um, and I'm just looking to make that natural step up, if you like. Um, I just wanted to run a couple of questions past you. Yeah, sure. H how much do you sell your Gallardo for out of interest? Yeah, so I got in the region of about 85,000 back for it, so not, not too bad. Okay, that's not bad at all. I'm guessing that's the LP560. Yes, that's the one. That's the one. Brilliant. Okay. So, obviously, with, with interest rates gone up currently, it, it's now really a good time to be financing the car, because obviously I'm going to be a finance buyer plus, plus my, my sort of PX money I've got for the, the, the Gallardo. It's, it's now a good time to be, to be financing. I mean, it, it is a general concern of buyers at the moment with the interest rates. However... When you look at the market as a whole, when you look at the broader context of things, take, for example, this hurricane. A year ago, this would have been circa 145, if not more, um, for a similar age spec mileage car. Now, in today's market, you're picking this up for £130,000, and that's a saving of over £15,000. Now, calculate the additional interest you're paying with the difference in interest rates, and it would never be a difference of £15,000 in a year's time. So... In essence, um, you're not exactly paying more for the car. Yes, you're paying more interest, but you're getting the price of the car a lot less, which essentially means it's not costing you anything extra. Sure, okay, fine. And then in terms of the car itself, I mean, how, how's the market performing over the next sort of 12 months, do you see? Well, uh, the, the market has slightly corrected in itself. As I rightly said, the, the car's probably fallen in about £15,000 um, over the past year. However... I do believe that last year, if not the year before that, the, the market was slightly inflated because there was a shortage of cars and now it's sort of coming to a price correction. Um, the good thing, especially when we talk in, in regards to the Hurricane, is Lamborghini have just announced that the Hurricane replacement is going to be a V8 twin turbo, which means that the Hurricane is going to be one of the last V10 models that they produce. Um, this is always going to be a good thing for whoever picks it up in today's market because as you've seen with the likes of the V12s and the SVs and the SVJs, they've jumped up, if not rocketed in price increase um, for the very fact that they're not making any more V12s. Um, so, yeah, in my opinion, I think it's a great pace, place to be. It's a safe place to be. And at that sort of money, at £130,000, you're getting a lot of car for the money. OK, fine. And, and my last question is really, if, you, if you've got a minute, if we could just do a quick quote. Yeah, sure. I'm, um, I'm just sitting in front of my laptop at the moment. So... I can run through some figures. What um, what deposit are you playing with? Yeah, I wasn't looking to put any more than twenty thousand down, so we, we'll go ahead with twenty. Okay, just give me a second. Okay, yeah. So I would recommend for a HP with a balloon deal. Now, twenty thousand pounds down as a deposit leaves you with thirty six monthly instalments of one thousand six hundred and forty pounds, um, and a final balloon figure of eighty eight thousand three hundred thirty two pounds. Okay, fine, that's not too bad. I mean, my Gallardo payments were only a few hundred pounds less than that, so it actually seems not too bad. I was expecting it to be slightly higher, I'll be honest with you. So, it's, it's actually a really about... cost-effective way of buying a car when you look at HP with balloons. I mean, unfortunately, not many people in the industry know about this, but people would advise for you to buy a supercar on a HP or a PCP where your monthlies are going to be uh, a much higher figure. But... In this instance, we're able to get you into a supercar for affordable monthlies, and because they don't depreciate as heavily as normal cars, you, you can get away with having a big balloon on them. No, fine, great. No, I've, I've never had that before, so um, no, fine, glad I've stumbled across you. Um, how can I go about getting the, the car of you, George? Okay, when suits you? Um, ideally, I can do tomorrow, if that works. Yeah, sure, the car's in the showroom, ready for viewing. Um, that's not an issue, I can pencil you in. What what time suits you? Um, if we can do 11am. Okay, yeah, brilliant, I've got a free slot then. And um, would you like to reserve the car in the meantime? I mean, is it, is it a necessity, um, or, or 
I'm so to work for you guys. It's not a necessity. However, I have to warn you that we've had instances where customers make a phone call saying they're on the way to the showroom and unfortunately in the space of an hour the car's gone. Um, I assure you it's not a sales tactic, but I just want to make you aware because we've had some very upset customers in the past where they've missed out on the car. And especially now you've seen it on Instagram, it is going to be getting a lot of people's attention. Yeah, no, I, I don't want to be losing out on this car. So um, fine, how much have we got to be putting down to secure it? I can reserve this car for you for £5,000. Okay, fine. Um, you've got my number saved, so if you could just send me over your bank details and I'll, I'll get that sent over to you now, George. Brilliant. All right, I'll, I'll WhatsApp you over the bank details and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Likewise. Thanks for your time, George. Thanks. See you then. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye. That's how it's done.